Well, it's a pretty quiet forecast out there early this morning. If you can put up with some chilly temperatures, 37 right now at Epley. Winds out of the south southeast at about 10 miles an hour. That, that's making those temperatures feel a little tougher out there. These are wind chills. And again, nothing too spectacular. It feels like 27 in Tacoma. Lincoln feels like 27 in Nebraska. City feels like 30 at Epley. But this should tell you you need to grab a jacket as you head out the door. Lots of clear sky out there right now. We're going to see a lot of sun as we go throughout the day. Let's go right into Storm Predictor. You can see as we roll through this morning, sunny, south winds warm us up very quickly, already in the, into the upper 50s, near 60 by the middle of the day. Going into the afternoon, there you go. Sunny weather continues. High temperatures today, topping out in the low to mid 60s in eastern Nebraska. I think low 60s for most of western Iowa. And then we'll knock back into the 50s by the time we drive home this evening. Going into the evening, clear. South winds keep temperatures in the upper 40s across Nebraska at 10 o'clock in the low 40s in western Iowa. And we'll have a few high thin clouds coming through overnight. Really nothing of uh, too much consequence as we go through Tuesday, probably partly sunny tomorrow afternoon. And then as we go into Tuesday night and Wednesday, big Veterans Day storm coming across the middle of the country. Some thunderstorms are possible on Wednesday. Some of them could be strong, especially in western Iowa. Widespread rain is expected. But I think the big story here, very strong winds late Wednesday, possibly gusting to near 50 miles an hour at times. Now we get one more day in the 60s on, on Veterans Day on Wednesday ahead of that storm. And then behind it, 53 for high Thursday, down to 48 on Friday. And we could finally see our first freeze of the year officially at Apley on Friday morning.